Hi everyone, uh, myself Avatai Gadiparthi. So in this video, you will actually learn so how many ways we can actually create a new field. Okay, so you will actually understand in how many ways we can actually create new field. So I have actually created a table called transport issue. So this is the table that I have actually created. So in this table, right? So from here, from the table columns, you can actually create a new field. So I'm actually creating a new field from here. This is actually one of the way to create a new field. So here there are actually multiple types of uh, fields available in the service no platform. So here when you click on the magnifying glass here, right? Here you will be able to see there are 53 types of uh, fields available in the service no platform. So we have actually 53 types of fields available. We have audio type, true or false type, calendar date time, choice, color, conditions, condition string, currency. So likewise, we have actually 53 types of fields available in the service no platform. So I'm actually selecting string type here. So I'm actually creating a field uh, that is actually of type of string. So here I'm actually creating, so enter something. So I have actually created a new field. So that is actually from the table columns. So maximum length I'm actually giving as 40, okay. So from the table columns, I have actually created a new field. So this is actually one of the way to create a new field guys. Okay. So from the table columns, we'll just click on new here. From here, you can actually create a new field. So now you will actually learn second way to create a new field guys. So you will just click on design form in the related links. So which you will see on the table, you will scroll little down here. So you will see related links. In the related links, you will just click on design form. So from the design form as well, you can create a new field. So how exactly you can create a new field is that I'll just show you. So here in the field types, right? You will go to the field types here. So let us say I want to create a date type field. You will just drag here and drop here. So here you will actually click on this settings icon. You will provide the name of the field, okay? So date of birth, okay? So this name also you can rename it, U underscore date underscore of underscore so date of birth so this is this is how you can actually create a new field this is actually another way to create a new field so we understand from the form design you can create a new field from the table columns you can create a new field so there is another way so that is actually from the list form list layout form so from the layout form as well, you can actually uh, create a new field. How exactly you can do that? You can just click on layout form here. From the layout form, so here you will be able to see create new field option. Okay. So here I'm actually creating the field name as, um, so I can actually name it uh, as name. So here you can just click on add here. So once you click on add, right, the name field is actually available here. Okay. So here, these two fields I'm actually pulling up. I'm just clicking on save here. So this is actually the third way to create a new field. Okay. So now we have actually understand three ways. One is from the table columns, you can create a new field. That is actually one way. And the second way is from the design form, you can create a new field. From the layout form, you can create a new field. So these are the three ways where you can actually create new field. Now I will actually explain the fourth way to create a new field, guys. So from here, right? From here, so what exactly you can do is, you can just click on show form here. So when you click on the show form here, right? So you will be able to see the transport issue form, something like this. So you can just right click, configure, go to the dictionary. So here also, you can actually create a new field. So I am going to create a new field here. So this is of, I'm actually taking string type here. Name of caller. So length I'm actually giving as 40. So these are the four ways where you can actually create a new field guys. See, so, there are actually four ways. One is from the table columns, you can create a new field. Another one is from the design form. Another one is from the layout form. And the fourth one is from the form, 
you can just click on the show form from the form you can directly navigate to the dictionaries by right clicking configure dictionary so so from here also you can actually create a new field so likewise guys you can actually create fields in multiple ways okay hope you enjoyed this session so if you like our videos please do uh, comment and subscribe our channel guys thank you very much